Hey everybody, this is Anime Free Chaos, and welcome back to The Legend of Heroes, Trails of Cold Steel 2. And guys, I do apologize, it has been a long, long time since the last time I uploaded for this series. My goodness, man. But, uh, in all seriousness though, um, if you guys saw my two previous videos, um, re actually recently, which was like my E3 2017 thoughts and impressions, I kind of briefly mentioned what I had going on as to why I didn't upload for a while. Uh, and hopefully you guys understood. Um, I, I, I mean, I didn't really go much into detail at all, but um, let's just say I, I, I needed a slight break. But anyway, uh, we're finally back. Seriously, we're finally back to this game. And um, I'm actually glad because it's been a while and I've been trying to, I've been itching to get back into this game. Considering how far close to the end, at least I'm assuming we are, to the end of this game. Um, and don't worry, I did a quick uh, recap for myself. You know, I watched the previous... Uh, <laughs> Last time I played, so let's also go ahead and check our notebook here. And uh, let me do also let me do a quick sound test here, guys. Give me one second here. Sorry about this. Sorry, give me a minute. Okay, I think we're good to go. Sorry about that, but anyway, um, but yeah, like I said, it's it's been a while since we last played, and. Uh, yeah. Oh, God dang it. Hang on. My monitor's acting up. <laughs> wow. What a way to start already. Uh, getting back into the game and already having a couple of random issues. Okay. There we go. It's fixed. All right. So let's go ahead and check our notebook. Uh, let me see. Under finale. So yes, we are still in Infernal ca Castle. Uh, from last time, if I remember correctly, we went through... Actually, let's go up the list here. Uh, yes, in the red text. So at the end of the second stratum, we found Zeno and Leonidas from Zephyr. Uh, they were kind of taunting us because when we got to the second um, end of the stratum, they pretty much drew a giant uh, symbol of Zephyr on the on the wall. So, uh, I mean, hey, at least they tried to paint, made it, make it interesting. You know, they painted the, the room slightly green. Well, the door, but you get what I mean. Uh, and here's what it's this, here's the weird thing: we did beat them. Surprisingly, the fight was not that difficult. But it's what they said that kind of made us worry too. Uh, well, right here it says they told us that it was actually their boss, the Jaeger King, who at who had asked them to make sure Fee left the core if he ever if he died during the fight with the um what was the group Red Constellation right so anyway uh, down here let's see Zeno and Leo told Fee that if she wanted to know where the other court members were and what they were doing she would have to defeat them first and earn those answers herself uh, Fee demonstrated her own resolve and the battle began with us almost co cornering them which was true you know we actually did pretty well against them uh, right here it says unfortunately they revealed that they had they had in fact been holding back which. When you really think about it, it's kind of, it's like a, it's a noticeable pattern so far after these past few boss fights. You know, one with Blue Blanc and Jubilee, they kept, they were holding back and then, you know, they got their second wind. Uh, and then same here, same thing for this fight. Uh, just as things looked desperate, we were saved by Captain Claire and Sharon, who inherited the battle from us so that we could move forward. Uh, as we departed, the two Jaegers told us that the rest of the Corps was working to bring back the boss. Uh, the true meaning behind those words is a mystery to all of us, but for now, all we can do is press on through to the third stratum. Considering what we've seen throughout this entire game, as well as the first game, I would not be surprised if they were able to bring back the boss. You know, I mean, you could have just easily done with the Phoenix down, but, you know, who am I to judge <laughs> on people's methods? But anyway, um, yeah, that's pretty much what happened last time, if I remember correctly. A anything else, though, was pretty much just exploring... Through the third stratum, so if we go to our map here. We were, I remember briefly saying that we're gonna just go ahead and finish up this area here, and then move back onwards. Um, yeah, so we're in Infernal Castle, third stratum one. Uh, what else happened? I'm trying to remember. I don't think did I get any new items. I don't think so. Sorry, just give me a quick second here. Again, it's been a while since I played this game, guys. So <laughs> please bear with me because it's like, oh no, I forgot how to play. <laughs> All right. Honestly, I'm just joking. Kind of. Uh, let me see here. Nothing new in terms of quartz. I think we got a couple, right? Deus Gem. Um, I still haven't decided who to give this to. I, I know I want to give it to Elisa, but I, I didn't really think of what to get rid of, you know? Or not get rid of, but just to switch out. I think I said I was going to maybe change um, t roll R. I was debating on that, right? Or it might have been Breeze. Probably t roll R, because that way I can have EP Cut 2 and, you know... EB cut three, so to say. But uh, anyway, like I said, we'll figure that all out towards um, when we get further in, I guess. But anyway, let's go ahead and move on. Oh, actually, first let's heal. Uh, <laughs> let's heal Laura first. Let's go to our. Let's go to Emma. Uh, Holy breath. One more time. 
There we go. And don't worry, we can always walk it off. We can get uh, her EP back by just walking around. Uh, speaking of which, though, I did read some of the comments you guys left um, left from last time, and I do apologize for not responding in time. Uh, actually, does this door open? It does. Wait. Aha! I see. Actually, you know, let's quickly go this way for a second. I just, I'm just curious. Okay, so no surprise attack, right? Nope. Okay, sorry. Just I'm just checking out here. So that leads back down that way, and that that's probably the way we have to go. All right, makes sense. Sorry about that. But yeah, um, at, whoa. You guys, see that? That was some serious lag. And look, Reen's floating in the air. That's kind of funny. <laughs> wow. All right. Uh, sorry about that. Again, distracted. Uh, to what I was saying, I did I did read some of your comments. Again, I, did, I apologize for not responding back in time, but um. Uh, who? What was it? Damn it! I'm drawing a blank. All right, you know what? Let's just fight first here. Let's get our. Let's get the game going. Get some action. This guy's trying to tackle me with his tentacles. There we go. Okay. So, uh, like I said, you guys spent, sent some comments. I didn't get a chance to respond to them. I do apologize. Um, no, I have. And first things first. No, I have not read anything on Trails of Cold Steel Three because, like I, like I said, I am f following through of not looking up any info. And trying to keep out of, you know, looking up stuff on the new on the new game. Because, you know, I want to wait until I beat this game first before I absorb all the new stuff that has been revealed so far for Trails of Cold Steel 3. So, no spoilers. Seriously. <laughs> um, other than that, though, we are still trekking along, guys. So, don't worry. Alright, speaking of which, let's go ahead and motivate. Alright, let's do this! <laughs> Restore some CP while we're at it. I can do this. Oh, of course. See, that could have been for Laura. <laughs> Alright, anyway. So let's see. Should I switch out people? Now nah, we're good. Let's just stick with it. Alright, so arts. Let's use... Um, oh, wow. Her EP is very low. I didn't realize that. Whoops. Uh, okay, let's go. We'll just attack normally. Screw it. There we go. Yeah, one of, one that comes was about uh, Trails of Cold Steel 3. Uh, but no, I did not look up any info because, like I said, I want to keep it... Uh, not... Like, I want to keep it, like... Not, see, not involved yet, you know, because I wanna, I wanna figure. Well, what? Well, yeah, God damn it, getting tongue tied. Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm just stuttering on, on what I'm trying to say. I wanna learn about it by myself. You know, I'll look it up all on my own without any help, so to say, because I wanna learn about it too. You know. Now. Not to say like I'm not saying no to your help. You know, I, I, I don't mind that, but I'm just saying I wanna learn about the world of Trails of Cold Steel, of Trails of Cold Steel Three when I get to that point. That's all I'm trying to say. Sorry. <laughs> All right, there we go. We'll and uh, I remember, I still remember that one tip you guys gave me back earlier for Emma. Give her um, art defense three, so that way her dodger will be a hundred percent. I almost forgot about that. But then for Elisa, I was thinking about giving her the uh, quartz that I give to Elliot, so that way um, Elisa can have constant EP recovery as well, instead of always relying on items too. Because at least when we, when we walk around, she'll recover EP just like Emma. Of course, Emma's uh, gives her extra sepith when she attacks enemies, too. All right, open the door. I do apologize if I'm stuttering too much. Again, it's like, <laughs> it's been a while since I made a video. I mean, besides the one about E3, but that was just me trying to get back into the process, you know? All right, so let's go up the stairway to heaven. See what this treasure chest is all about. It is, oh, here we go. Oh, isn't this a pleasant surprise? There's a treasure chest here. Okay, let's see what's inside. What's good? Celestial armor. Ooh. Is that for guys too? Wait, did we ever get something like that? Oh no, Alfred's armor, alright. Uh oh, it's for women. Yeah, it didn't show for the guys. Let's see. Celestial armor. Uh oh wow, look at that. Alright, so a mer a miraculous armor from a forgotten legend that glows silver. Women only. So let's see. You get strength 40, defense 970. Wow, that's a big jump in defense. Uh, arts 40, Arts Defense 670, oh my goodness. And Evasion plus 10%. That's not bad, guys. That's pretty damn good. Um, wow, I could actually give that to Elisa if I wanted to, because that would really jump her, uh, that would really boost her defense a lot, too, because she is kind of a glass cannon. Although similar to Emma, too. Let's see, 1583, 1598, and then 1321 and 1638. Hmm. Because, well, if I give this to her, her art, well, art defense, art, that yeah, arts, not art defense, sorry. Arts goes up by 15 points, okay? And then Emma, 
does that too. I don't know. I'm, I'm kind of slumped too. Wait, 40. Wait, what the? Oh, it's because of the Ebony Vets. I see. Yeah, 25. And then for Emma, it would actually get a big boost in 40. Wow. You know, I'm actually kind of inclined to give this to Elisa. Or, I'm sorry, not Elisa. Um, Emma instead. Actually, that, oh, it's a matching set too, actually. So yeah, Virgo Boots. See, Boots from a Forgotten Legend that give off a silver light. And then Miraculous Armor from a Forgotten Legend that glows silver. You know what? Just because it does make some sense, I'll give it to Emma. Yeah, let's give it to Emma. Here we go. All right, three, two, one. Nice. Nice boost. All right. So, yeah, cool. Matching set for uh, Emma here. <laughs> um, I will say this could also benefit um, Laura, too. Actually, here. We'll take it off for a quick second. Sorry about that. So, for Laura, let's see. Evasion. Her evasion will go by 20. And then arts and art defense... Okay, not too bad. Yeah, but no, we're gonna give it to Emma. Sorry about that. So let's steal armor. And then actually, I think I can give uh, Lisa better stuff, right? Oh, actually, no. That well, that lowers it by a little bit, because her defense will get a boost, and then her art defense drops by 40 points if I take this off. Hmm. Decisions. And then same thing with the ebony boots. Because everything will increase by, by at least 200 points, at least for the uh, defense. 220, give or take. Hmm. Uh, I guess we'll wait. Alright, it's fine. Because remember, there is a lot of better equipment in the store. It's just very pricey. Alright. Anyway, let's move on. So we open that door. And um, I believe it's an enemy, right? Like last time where we fought the Nosferatu. So just because we know that's coming up, let's go ahead and heal Elisa's uh, EP while we're at it. I was kind of hoping uh, there would be like a charging station along the way, but it's it's fine. There we go. That should be enough. And I think we're good. Yeah. All right. Let's go. Bring it on. Aha. Okay. It's another Nosferatu. Please take care around that one. Wait, is there another enemy? I only see. Yo, let's go. Come here, you. Fight me. Even though I'm cheating. Haha. -ha. Oh shit. <laughs> you can go downstairs. <laughs> Ah, cool. I, I still tagged him. All right, let's do this. Watch out. This is a tough one. Oh crap! The mirror enemies. Let's move. If I remember correctly, they killed me last time, right? Didn't they like cast? Um, oh, what spell was it? I, I totally forgot. But you—they killed me last time, I think. Oh no, no, no! It was the other one. Never mind. All right, sorry. Uh, Nosferatu, same thing. Immortal King takes the souls of innocents and devours them. Weak against Mirage and time, and not against space. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's do this. Uh, motivate. All right, let's do this. Leave it to me. <clears throat> right. Okay, Elisa. Let's go ahead and All right, this won't do much. Maybe a flare bomb, or actually craft. Uh, yes, heavenly gift. Here we go. Light. Rain upon us. There we go. Sparkle, goddamn sparkle. <laughs> of course. All right, arts, let's go ahead and, and let me see. I could do, actually, let's do support. Here we go, Crescent Mirror. Huh? And then Laura My here, turn. she's going to kill every. No, nah, I'm joking. <laughs> All right, um, well, technically she could, but now nah, let's let's bide our time here. Let's go ahead and use Radiant Spin. Oh, I could have sworn the range was bigger. Wait, oh, no, it's just the positioning. All right, hang on. I could kill four of those. I can't go here. See, uh, let me see if I can play it right. Here we go. Uh, but I feel like that's a waste of her domination. Hang on. Uh, Radiant Blade? Uh, same thing. Earth Cleaver. Damn it. All right. Ah, screw this. Here, let's do it. Here we go. Take them all out. Witness the fruits of my training. <laughs> and from the last from the last videos I did, um, from the last session, it seemed like I was struggling to get uh, Laura's E. CP back up, too. But we'll see. Let's see how this hits. Oh, well then. <laughs> oh, yay. 20 CP back. <laughs> okay, well, can't complain. There we go. All right. All right, awesome. More level ups. Okay. Good to go. All right. <laughs> I've only just begun. 
Yes, yes, you have. I'm so glad. Success. I'm awesome. All right, there we go. Defeated another one. And that should, yep, lower the bridge. Cool. Ah, now I remember the other uh, comment. So, yeah, there was another comment that was said last time, too. And basically, it was um, to not forget to level up the other guys, you know, which was Machias, Gaius, Uses, and Elliot. And don't worry, I have no intention of leaving them behind in the dust. Um, I think the plan is, if there is another recovery area, you know, like a save point before the final boss, I think. I hope, we, I hope there is one. Um, I mean, there probably is, but still, like, if there is that part... I might actually do a quick grind session off camera, maybe, to help get them up to stuff. That way, they won't be so totally defenseless, bleh, defenseless against the final bosses, you know? So, I mean, that, at least that's the plan in my head, you know? Alright, um, so the tri I think the charging station's down below, right? So, probably best to just go ahead and heal? Ow, actually, yeah, let's fight these two enemies first, and then we'll go run back down to heal everyone. Also, because we gotta recover Laura's CP. <laughs> Aha! More aliens! Come here, you. Oh. Aha! Afraid! Take that! Okay, so far so good. We have the advantage! I took a bit of time, I will say that, but uh, at least we're getting there. Here we go. Right, craft, motivate. Alright, let's do this! Under Leave the it I gotta get Laura's uh, CP back up as quickly as possible here. <laughs> Light. If I can. Rain upon us. There we go. It's my turn. Ooh, zero arts. No, no. Like I said, I want to get uh, Laura's stuff back quickly. So let's just use Crescent Mirror. It was, it's tempting. It's always tempting to use Lost Arts, but uh, sometimes you got to take priority over certain things. Okay, Laura. Let me see. Let's take out... Let's see. What did these do? HP, EP, and CP. Okay, and then these things uh, reflect it. Okay. Let's take out an alien first. Here we go. All right. Almost. There we go. Here I go. All right. Let's do another art. Let's use... Oh wow, see if I if I do whoa. I could do this now too. Nah. You know what? We'll attack. Ah, screw it. I guess we can use an art. Let's use Silverthorn. Why not? And <laughs> she gets another turn. Great. Alright, cool, they're not dead at least. Okay, that's fine. Here I go! Um, let's go ahead and we'll just move you. Here we go. Let's go over here. Let's move. All right, you. I'm actually gonna motivate one more time. Right, let's do this. I'm trying to speed up Laura's uh, CP recovery process here. Leave this to me. All right, you will attack. Let's attack the weaker ones here. All right, now she's at 100. Okay. Of course. Let's see. Let's attack the one in the back. Yes. All right, almost dead. Right. Uh, attack this one. Fire. Okay, good. My turn. Right, you'll vanish this one. Ha! Oh, resistant. Okay. Uh oh, casting. Onward. You better take care of it, Laura. Now's our chance. All right, follow up. There we go. Here I go. All right, and then last but not least, I guess we'll let her finish it. It's all good. No problem. Actually, nah, yeah, we'll just finish it. Let's go. All right, let's keep on moving. Okay. So far, so good. Lisa's about to level up as well. That's funny. She's the she's the one person trailing behind slightly. I don't get why. Because she was leveling up the same time as everyone else almost, but <laughs> he's floating up the stairs. <laughs> Come here, you alien. Oh. Didn't mean to aggro you. Are you gonna come back down or are you stuck? Oh, oh! <laughs> I guess he did aggro him. My bad. There we go. All right, just turn around. Stop waving your hands in the air like you don't care. We got this. Oh really? 
My turn. <laughs> that could have been used for Flora. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> All right, let's uh, do this. Damn it, game. <laughs> Give us the good ones too. I can do this. Uh, all right, anyway, let's see. Let's use... I guess we can use Fortuna. Let's go ahead and use it. Might as well. More sparkly goodness. Okay. It's my turn. Actually, you know what? I could use a crap... Nah. I was going to use her uh, Moonlight thing, but I feel like that's a waste of CP. Well, not really a waste, but a little unnecessary. Let's see, who has more health? This one. I love that it freezes almost instantly now. All right, actually, that's not kind of true. I mean, I did just get back into this game, so it's kind of false. <laughs> I'm just, I meant the rate of seeing more enemies frozen is kind of happening a lot so far. Okay, um, let's go ahead and attack. Actually, let's just let her move. Reen, go. go ahead and motivate one more time. Right, let's do this. Probably this next attack should recover Laura's, I believe. Of course. Oh, I was wrong. Okay then. Uh, screw it. Here we go. Blessing of the moon. <laughs> like I said, I thought it was unnecessary, but it's like let's just get it out of the way. Come on. No problem. Alright, attack it. There we go. All right, let's keep on moving. Yeah, let's keep moving. All right, there we go. One, everyone's now 127. Although Reen's still in the lead, surprisingly, along with Sarah. <laughs> uh, I'm so glad. Okay, so now let's quick up, let's make a quick run back to the recovery device and heal up, and then, if we can, probably get one more fight in, so that way Emma can get her CP back to max. I could have sworn there was also an item where if you ran around, you would get CP too. Or I, I'm pretty sure it was the one, it was the quartz where if you, you can attack enemies on the field and your CP would recover. I think. Right, anyway, here we go. Let's go ahead and heal up. Again, like I said a few mi minutes ago, so far so good. It's kind of back to be in the groove here. Okay. Um, so everyone's fully healed. Let's, you know what, yeah, let's go ahead and just fight one more enemy. That should be enough to bring uh, Laura's, or I'm sorry, Emma's CP back up. Oh, where's that angry, there's an evil mirror here. Right, come on. Follow me, Mr. Mirror. Demon mirrors of doom. Running the circle power. Here we go. Aha. <laughs> the advantage is ours. I would hope so. Okay. Let's move. All right, there we go. Motivate. Right, let's do this. Leave Leave the the there we go. I can do this. All right, it's only ten, so probably Emma can get it in like two or three hits, maybe, give or take. All right, arts. Uh, let's do a. Maybe that's too much. Volcanic rain. Leave this to me. Uh, you're out of the circle, so we'll kill you. Oh, almost death. All right, never mind. Of course. All right, critical. So this should be. 16542, 16542. This one. How about this? Awesome, there we go. Gotcha. Oh, oh, stats attack, volcanic rain. Nice, okay. Right. Alright, well then, no need to waste any more time. Let's do this. <laughs> ah. This never gets old. I'm sorry. Just seeing a giant Pokeball kill my enemies is kind of hilarious. And now it's a giant meteor. Ah, yes. Nice and, nice and toasty. Ta-da. Here. Thanks. Oh, and free recovery, thank you. <laughs> All right, let's keep on moving. Okay, that's it. All right, let's keep going. Man, we got a lot of Sepith. <laughs> Besides the space one. All right, now we can go back. So hopefully the enemies didn't recover back on that long bridge, right? All right, one alien. That's okay. Uh, let's go back this way. The way we came. I was debating whether or not to run back down to the recovery device, but it's like, yeah, we're we're almost here. Let's go. 
One more enemy fight, and then we'll uh, progress. Oh, two. Uh, you know, let's just run past them. I know XP is important, but I think we we wasted it. Not wasted, but like, let's just go on. Let's see. This is Infernal Castle Third Stratum. Okay, let's go. All right, let's see. Ah, whoa. Let's see. Okay, more switches to hit. Gotcha. And there's the end down here. I don't know why. Does it look like it's lagging to you guys? I don't think so. All right, I don't know, man. I'm just... All right, anyway. So, two enemies in front of us. Go down this way. Treasure chest there. And then we want to go... Ah, so we probably had to cross the external corridor. Okay, simple. Go that way. All right. Okay, pretty simple. Let's go. Right, come on. Come here, you aliens. You alien scum. Oh, God. Oh, God. No, no! Oh! I got... Shit. Oh, crap, baskets. The camera got me. God damn it. Alright, well, that pisses me off a little bit. Alright, um... Switch you out with... Green? This is such weird positioning, but you know what? Screw it. They pissed me off. Alright, um... Let me see here... Let's go ahead and... Shit, which one do I do here? Chrono Drive? Speed up time? Actually, yeah, Chrono chrono Burst, Mari. My bad. Yeah. Wow, that's really annoying. I hate when that happens when the camera doesn't, like... Okay, no, it's not the camera's fault. It's my own fault for my getting turn. stuck in a corner like that. I was trying to go around the enemy that, that stopped, but I, got, I accidentally ran to the damn pillar. And that screwed me over. So, I can only blame myself for that. All right, let's go ahead and attack. Here we go. Got to get our links back together, too, while we're at it. All right, motivate. Let's do this. All right, quickly link back. There we go. All right, arts. Let's use a flare bomb. Probably on this guy. Here I go. All right, and then you will cast... Actually, let's raise our... Uh, no. It's arts. Let's see, Phantom Phobia. All right, let's see what's going to happen, though. All right, nice dodge. All right, good job, Laura. Here we go. All right, what's the next guy? Ah, of course. <laughs> Got this one. All right, nice. So this is overkill for this poor enemy. I think this is actually the second or third time that I actually got attacked from behind by an enemy. When I really think about it. We aren't done yet. Okay, bring it on. My turn. Okay. Uh critical. Over here. Straight ahead. Now. An opening. There we go. You're finished. Oh, nice. Damn, Reen. I can do this. <laughs> Someone hit the gym this time. Leave this to me. Hit. This one has more health, actually, so let's hit this one. There we go. Shit, I think I knocked him out of the circle for the other guy. Damn! Oh, nice! Okay, cool. She changed targets. I was about- I was a little worried that it, uh, it wasn't gonna auto-target, but it did. Of course. Okay, um, actually, we can let you heal. Holy Breath? Oh, at least it's just out of range. That's annoying. You know what? It's fine. Let's move. Actually, I can I can be a little smart here. Maybe I can move it down here. Oh, it's on Laura. Or was it? Oh no, okay, it was on Reem. My bad. There we go. Everyone's fully healed now. All right, dodge, dodge, dodge. Nice. Good job. Finish it. Okay, good. Our fighting was in perfect sync. When I could keep up, at least. Okay, good. Bit of a mishap there, but we cleared it. <laughs> okay, and also now would be a good time to split the part, too. So let's go ahead and quickly do that. Save. All right. Man, it's been a while. I looked at the dates, too. Look, the 6. June 6, man. <laughs> My God. <laughs> All right. And it's almost, you know, it's almost July. My goodness. Can't believe <laughs> time flew by that quickly, guys. Wow. Okay, give me a second here, and then we will be right back. 